I'm sorry I didn't record anything today. I brought my phone to Taekwondo practice with every intention of recording some of it to show you all what happens there. But it turns out it's really hard to record anything when you're doing Taekwondo. So I think we're just gonna leave it. And if someday, for some reason, I'm able to record some Taekwondo practice, it'll be amazing. But until then, it's just gonna be a mystery. And hopefully I'll have something interesting to show you tomorrow. I bought some coconut bonbons. It tastes pretty much like what it sounds like. It's coconut. It's not a very exciting story, but it's, again, it's the only story I have from today. I had orchestra rehearsal. It was our dress rehearsal. Um, so the concert's on Saturday, and that's exciting. I went to the grocery store, and I got ingredients for uh, lentil soup. This really good lentil soup that I learned about over the summer. I made it before. It was a little weird because it was too much lime. So I'm going to try to make it again this time. And it'll, be, and it'll be good. Plus I have lentils that I need to use. And I bought cilantro. Cilantro is awesome, by the way. If you've never like cooked with it before, I highly recommend it. I was thinking I should try to do some kind of edit-free Friday thing. Like If you've watched Cassandra's vlogs, you know those are... Uh, well, she does daily vlogs for one thing, and on some Fridays she would declare it an edit-free Friday where uh, she wasn't allowed to cut out segments from her speaky-talky portions to the camera things. So the idea is that you have to be very articulate and you can't start over what you're saying. Except I do vlogs every three days, so I'm not sure whether it would be a three-day uh, edit-free thing or or just for one of the three days or what I don't know anyway the Super Bowl the Super Bowl is on Sunday so I'm thinking of going with a couple friends of mine we're thinking of trying to go to a bar on Sunday somewhere in Chicago and watch the Super Bowl none of us follow football at all except you know the Broncos are in it this year so I suppose I have to support my home state concert day on Saturday which I already mentioned that's February 1st That'll have been a month without watching any of my YouTube subscriptions or going on Reddit or Tumblr or Twitter <coughs> or Facebook. Well, I went on Facebook a little bit because I had to, there was someone I was trying to get in contact with that I couldn't get in contact with any other way. Uh, but that'll have been a month without doing any of those things. And I'm glad I was able to do it. Like, I don't think it's going to be a problem to get to Saturday. I don't know what's going to happen after that, though. Like, I've had all sorts of time for other things, like doing vlogs, and staying on top of my homework, and not really many other things, but I did visit one language learning website once, called Duolingo, and I learned some French. I can now say, Le garçon mange le pomme. And that's about the extent of my vocabulary. But when I start watching YouTube again, which I probably will, I mean, I like YouTube. It's not like it was just a bad habit that I had to get rid of. I think there's a lot to be gained from watching those videos. So I'm going to start watching that again, and I'm going to have less time for everything else. I don't know. I've been recording here for eight minutes. Clearly, I mean, usually I have a point that I'm trying to get across when I'm talking to the camera. Like, I'll be thinking for a few minutes ahead of time, oh yeah, I should tell them about this. So then I take out the camera, make my point in like 30 seconds, and poof, out of there. But, um, but right now I'm kind of just trying to make up for the fact that I haven't talked to you guys at all in the last two days. I promised myself that I would tell my parents, I would give them the link to this channel uh, on the day I upload the sixth video, so... If you're watching this now, I'll have told my parents about this. So, hi mom, hi dad, hi any other relatives that they may have invited to watch. I was hoping that by six videos I would have hit my stride and I would uh, not feel a little bit uncertain about the whole is it going to be possible to keep vlogging thing. But I, at this point I'm still not sure whether I'm going to have stuff to vlog about in the future because there's nothing really coming up that I can videotape either except maybe the Super Bowl thing. This is the way that I usually write my journal entries though, by the way, is I'll just like kind of, I'll have a couple of things that I wanna say, and then I just sit down and I just start writing and then it's kind of a blob. Kind of a blob of word vomit.
tell you what, if you're watching this and you have an opinion and you think that there's something that I should videotape that you would be interested in, let me know, because I need ideas, all right? Just leave something in the comments saying, hey, Nathan, I'm super curious. What kind of toothbrush do you use? And then I'll show you my toothbrush. It's like a two-way thing. You picking up what I'm putting down? Yeah? Good? Okay, great. So why is it possible? Why should this be possible? Okay. Well, the reason people believe it's possible is that the notion that these activities have characteristic patterns that are backed up in one another. Okay. So there is some kind of mapping that's possible between these statistics uh, and um, the end activity. That's a cool looking wall. If you got the red light causing the shadows going out radially because of the bricks that are sticking out, I think that's cool. The fire department. 